toys for the new year. And what I mean by toys is not serious works of art, bits and pieces you might have in the workshop that you fiddle around with but never get round to finishing, or if you finish them, you never get round to trying them actually in the water. Um, one of the first ones I've got here is an ASV boat. Um, air supported vehicle. It's like a, a solid form of hovercraft really. No skirts around the outside. Pumps air underneath to form a bit of a layer between the bottom of the boat and the surface of the water. Well the principle I suppose is the same as we might get a boat up onto the plane. Once you get the hull out of the water it makes it much easier for the boat to travel and it needs less effort. So the boat is travelling on a layer of air instead of on top of the water. Well that's the principle anyway. The next one is a little plastic uh, toy tug. I was intrigued with it because it's got a built-in small water jet. It's got a water jet, uh, it's got a cannon, water cannon that fires, it's got flashing lights, it's got a siren, all in a tiny little boat. <laughs> but it hadn't got radio control. So I needed to pull it apart and install a bit of basic uh, radio control. And as you can see, it's finished. Um, instead of the ordinary painting of the deck and that, I did a bit of painting to make it look a little bit more realistic. But there again, it works on the bench and I expect it will work in the water, but never been tried. The other one is the bottle boat. Finished it, all the bits and pieces, pumps, dive planes are made from uh, rudders, ordinary uh, model boat rudders. Um, the back end is a clip from uh, guttering. Got it all together. Idea seemed to work. Never finished it. It's a solar boat, but using a paddle wheel. Made up a paddle wheel. Uh, the back with some pulleys, a bit of electronics, a flexible solar panel added to the roof so I could bend it a bit to the shape of the boat. Um, there's an auxiliary uh, propeller on that underneath in case the sun goes in, which it often does. Finished it all together, a few transfers, and once again it never went to the water. So I must take that down the park one day just to see how efficient it is or inefficient. But there we go. Twin hull, solar powered boat. And ah, there is one more to finish off. It's a rocket launching boat. A launching craft, not a landing craft. The idea is it powers itself out the same as a conventional model. Um, it can lift its launch rail up and on the signal launch a rocket into outer space. Well, not quite, but I think you get the idea. So, roll on the new year and let's see how many of these bits and pieces I can get tested. Catch up with you all again soon.